This video is about how to work out the area of composite shapes. These are shapes which basically are made up of a number of different parts, and different main shapes like this one here, which is made up of a couple of different rectangles. So the way you do this is you break it up into the different shapes which are easy to work out. In this case, this north and the lower shape becomes two rectangles. Okay, the area of this first shape up here, I'm going to change everything from millimetres to metres. Area is 7 metres by 4 metres. So the area of the big shape there is 28 metres. Then you work out the area of the little shape. Okay, that's 3.5 metres by 3 metres, which gives us 10.5 metres altogether. Now to work out the total area of this composite shape, you just add these guys together. So we get 28 metres plus 10.5 metres which gives us all together 38 and a half metres squared. Okay, so the steps there are involved. First off, what we did is we broke up the shapes into their individual parts. We worked out the area of those individual parts, and then we added those together. We'll give another one a try. This shape's a little bit harder, but not too bad. As you'll see, it can be broken up into three different rectangles here. We work out the area of this top little one here, and what we'll see, and this will all be in metres again, is it's three by 1.5 metres, which gives us 4.5 metres. To work at the area of this big rectangle, we have a bit of a problem. We don't quite know what one of the sides is. So what we have to do is we have to get 9,200 and take off 4,600, and that will give us that side length, which is also 4,600. So the area metres squared of the big rectangle we can work out now is 12 by 4.6 which altogether is 55.2 metres squared. Finally, we have to work out the top rectangle. The area in metres squared of that is 4.6 metres by 4.5 metres, which gives us the answer of 20.7 metres squared. Finally, what we have to do is we have to total all these up. So, we get all these, we go Total area is 4.5 plus 55.2 plus 20.7, which gives us 80.4 metres squared. Well, I hope that was of some help to you. Okay, bye.